of the Valley's Enduro. It's not in a field. You're excited to ride. Yeah, pinners. 2.7k, 24. So it's going in blind. Very, very whoopy. If you had a throttle, it would be fantastic. <laughs> yeah. Also on the front. Need to got a bit more flow. Look at that. This is good. I like this one. You went over it with a semi on. He used to run better now. Oh my. Good morning, guys. It is Sunday, the 12th of March. And although it still feels like winter, it is the second round of the Valley's Enduro. Todd and I got our first wins two weeks ago. Uh, it's been taken to one day event. Usually it's track walk Saturday, but there's been heavy snow. All gone now, as you can see. So, 5.15 in the morning, quick dip, bit of brekkie, head over to South Wales. Dead true. Are you on the day entry? No. You entered it, no? You excited to ride? Yes, I am actually. Don't mind it wet. When we got here, I had a massive deja vu, and then I remembered I've raced here before doing the WOR Dawn Till Dusk six hour Enduro about. How long ago will that be? 2008, maybe? Must be a long time ago. Yeah. bit of information for you. You do six hours now on a mountain bike. Yeah. No ski, tell the pins people what you've got. We've got to be quick, so we're about to go. Right. On. Three, two, one. Uh, purple hubs, um, new mech, new shifter, um, replace the bars and stem, uh, new whole wheels. Not half wheels. No, new tyres. <laughs> and that's it. Yeah, pinners. <laughs> new Dior shifter. 11 speed rear Mac and 11 speed rear cassette. Just to treat it, that's like gold compared to the micro shit. Today's little thing, I don't even know if they still work, I've had them two years and just charged them up, is heated socks. And also, we've got these, just like some plastic disposable gloves to go underneath the riding gloves it's going to be wet look at them things look like something you've nicked off your granddad what are they? <laughs> they like thermal trousers yeah because i'm going to wear some waterproof trousers which are cold at the best of times you always wear a knee brace no knee pads oh it looks like a knee brace camera wise today uh the last two videos of this camera have been on 2.7k 60 Someone suggested 24, so 2.7k, 24 frames per second. So I'm going to try that today. Give me comments on that compared to the 60. Uh, obviously, I don't know until I edit the video. Mr. Hughes, would you like to tell people why uh, Mr. Crooks isn't here today? Because he stubbed his toe. <laughs> That's about <The> right. <laughs> He's got a, 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 a poorly toe. His hobbit foot has become even bigger. Are we ready to rip? Sai has joined us from Psycho Mud Guards. Here he is, the man. Ready for noisy, noisy breaks all day. Yeah. Green electric beast, liking it? Good, aren't they? Yeah, love mine. So format today is mash up as usual. We haven't walked the tracks because of the weather situation. So it's going in blind, steady runs to start with. Try and find some lines. I think it's gonna be slippy. Big old queue for stage one. Just gonna to have to get in it because two starts at the bottom of this. Oh well. Right, so, seeding lap I'll call it. It is timed, but I'm gonna be behind Si on this one, hopefully. Right, hello. Wow, it looks fruity straight away. Nice. 
<laughs> it's proper off piece proper soily very very whoopy yo quick camera wipe if we can get away with it quite nudgery wow I wouldn't want to be riding a regular bike on this. It'd be hard work in those whoops. On the gas. All right. Whoa, he's nearly off. Stage one completed, quite short. Pedally whoop whoop whoop, isn't it? Stage one done, not sure about that trail. It's, uh, if you had a throttle, it would be fantastic, but I don't think you're gonna be able to get any pace. Right, stage two. We've got the Psycho signage on here. Psycho has sponsored the event. Oh my God, okay, see we? Let's see if this one goes downhill a bit more. Go and get him. That up straight away. A bit better so far. Oh, still quite pedally here. Oh, I'm like a bit too, bit too bumpy to get on the pedals. Sat down, spinning, no point trying too hard. And now we've caught the regular bikes up. Oh dear, is he going for the overtake? He is. Oh my God, puddles are deep. Yeah, that bit's good. <laughs> oh, it's really difficult to keep it rolling on some of these turns we're now in the queue for stage three and uh, i've spotted something here that gives this lad the status of bravest person in the whole race what's your name dude adam by none and what tires are you running today oh, my, i can't even remember they are i know what they are because i used to run them on the rear minion ss not only on the rear and on the front also on the front so if you can get down all these in one piece you're a you're a brave lad <laughs> what do you reckon go on have it it's only a sighting lap anyway all right come on so tight Could have just gone straight right there. I'll just seat up, spinning, use all the power right now. I've just stood up, not dropped me at all.
Whoop. Come on. A bit better. At least we've got a bit more flow. Oh, hey. Well, that was close. I'm catch him now. Oh, I'm glad we got these specialized hillbillies on. A lot of that was better. This last bit was good. Yeah. If you want to see how shitty the bikes are getting, look at that. So we've done a big old transition. Stage four, we've probably been going about five miles. How big are these wind turbines when you're close? Look at that. So apparently, as I was saying, one rotation will power your house for a day and the tips turn at 200 mile an hour. Right, go on then. So, this is the start, but it's not the official start. The timing dip is further down, so we're not racing this bit. There's no point trying to go like a twat. Oh, I should have had it in. Wonder why they didn't. Ah, uh, and there's the start there. Right, stage four. Kind of, kind of defogged the goggles. Come on. Oh god, that's a bit nasty. This is good, I like this one. Why? Nice, nicely cleared. I just rode it. Bit of a pedal. God, dude. I know she's going to be so fast down here later on when he gets back on the proper, proper go. And that's that. You did well clearing that gap. Fuck yeah, I only still like to get that gap. I just rode it. Fuck yeah, it's a big gap that. Well, I know, yeah. <laughs> I kind of forgot how easily the DJI camera comes off. So I'll do a bit of filming with this one. And uh, we've done our three now, our four, at steady pace. Time to get out and try and put the hammer down and get some times. If I can keep up with Stu, I know I'm doing all right. Now at stage two, we're pretty happy with three and four. We might go back there later if we've got plenty of time and see if we can get it a bit quicker. But now trying to do two and one. Stage four, as we're in the area, try and put a time in. Horrible corner to start with. That one! He didn't jump that, he's trying to tell me he jumped that. I was like, you did not. Jump up. Come on. Ah, horrible turn that one.
Nice. Whew. <laughs> All right. All right. That's rode it. Yeah. Where's the little shit? Yeah. Only a little bit, but what's the three left? Uh, bottom of three's good. No. I just don't like the first left-hand corner. I'm shit at it. Oh, shit round it. And, the, and there's a right, but we do three. Hey? We do, can do three. Yeah, are you happy with that? I, I don't think we're going to get it much faster, do you? We need to just go and get a lap on the others, really. Yeah, OK, let's go do three then. How'd you get on then? Yeah, all right. Yeah, I'll see what you mean. I sort of semied it. I quick <laughs> you went over it with a semi on. Here we go. If anyone wants to fill their bottles up, some lovely water from in there. Right. Getting to the stage where it's hot. Oh, for God's sake. Bits falling in my goggles. Foggy. Stage three. Let's try and put a pace down. Hughes in front. I've got Vinny behind me. Go on. Does ah. <laughs> it hold you up much? I just want to have a look at it. I'm going to do that line down the tree next time. Cheeky, isn't it? How was that? Hard work. I saw you stood up cranking and you did get away a bit, but if I stood up and cranked, I'd go no faster. Yeah, yeah that's a right. long pedal through that lot. Yeah, I think the SL was good there, but it did yeah, look like you were yeah. trying. I think I'd like rather have full fat, wouldn't you? Definitely, mate, yeah. 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 Especially through them little apps. Yeah. Five metres of an uphill, that's when you need a full fat e -bike. Yeah. Yeah, I can't put any power down then. Yeah. So hard to just get your goggles right, isn't it? As soon as you put them on when they're damp, they start steaming. Let's have it. Oh, that bit's horrible. Oh, followed him on a shit line then. Tried to inside that corner and it didn't work. Gone on the lightweight. Ah, I'm just sat down spinning. Ah, oh my god, this has got wetter. Don't particularly want to do that again. No, me. Oh, hey! <laughs> nice one, dude. There is Rich. Who runs the event just stopped and asking us all about what it was like for some criticism so we just said one doesn't quite work because it's a bit flat and too lumpy to pedal on uh, and some of the corners are a bit tight but really good really good uh, you know it's really hard to do this sort of stuff constructive criticism that's what he wanted Time. The weather is grim. Checking in it, We're just checking in. Hi, it's Mr. Hughes. Where are you? Position. Right, How are you, mate? Yeah. Third. Third. Currently third. Yeah. Got some work to do. Dibber's in, Stu. I can't yeah. film it and dib it at the same time. Dibber, dibber, you're oh, Give me your arm then, son. <laughs> oh, you're recording yourself. Oh yeah, of course, you're a YouTuber, aren't you? I've Here seen we go. you on YouTube, I've you. seen you on YouTube. Oh yeah. My dad's shown you a channel for me. You are currently, right. I can't even see it. Are you checking your finish yet? Yes, I'm well done. Chatting, please. Back out to one, we've got a nice fast bit of fire road here. Quite good fun. A little chilly, I'm not cold actually, I'm alright. I'm not sure if these heated socks are working. Right guys. Stage one, second run. The only one we've still need to repeat. Behind the huge man. And we're going to attack this, aren't we? Attack it. Attack! Got no goggles on for this one, so hopefully I don't get shit in my eyes. Wait. Come on. He needs to run better now. Come on. Come on.
pumps are sort of feel like they've ironed out a bit. Nice of water in. Not a bad run though. Oh, Christ. That wasn't a bad run, was it? It feels like the humps have dug out a bit and they're not as humpy. Yeah. We have come up the hill and sort of veered off right to try and get to the state top of one. I have absolutely no idea where we are really. We know roughly, but I'm not going to use the word lost just yet. Hi ladies, check out the size of my wind turbine. Bloody massive. Woo. After all that, we're in the right direction. We are here at the top of stage one again. Oh, hang on, I need to get up here, so otherwise it's like an uphill start. Fucking shite, all over my hands now. Go for it, son. See me goggles. Ooh, that was a bit of a nasty, nasty rock. Oh, oh, I caught the wheel then. Oh, that right up. Mess this one up. Oh, it up at the top. That was a horrendous run then. That was one like one error followed by more errors. So as Kev stretches out his cramp. We're going for third run of stage two. And then I'm on like a 17% battery. So that'll do me then. I got another battery in the van, but I can't be asked to swap it. Happy with everything. Let's get a not final, second to final run. Never say that. And then we'll go back and see how we got on. Right then. Go on, Stu, be really fast. I'm going to actually try and sprint on the flat bits this time. All right, all right mate. Try and relax a bit more. Oh, oh, oh. You know? <laughs> we can go back up, yeah, yeah. Right, gloves are really slippy and my grips are, so as I'm not using my goggles anymore, I'm going to use the goggle cleaner on my grips and gloves. Oh, I'm so innovative. Hate it when your grips get slippy. Okay. Luck, See if we can get past the fourth corner. Feeling good actually, I'm not feeling tired at all. Because training's definitely paid off. Whoa, that hole's a right bastard, isn't it? Oh, I've got shit in my right eye. Trying to blink it out. It's pretty big. Come on, get out. <sighs> Come on, give him a moment. He's uh, sure is slippy now. Oh, don't get it moving. I can't I'm see done that. now. I've had enough. You'd have to know that so well to be able to get it right. It's all about getting the right gears, isn't it? Stewie's going off for another go of stage three. I'm done. I've got, uh, I don't know. 12% battery or something. Can't even see it, I'll show you in a sec. And then uh, I'm gonna dip in. I've really enjoyed it. At first I wasn't too keen, but um, you know, like stage one and two, but I kind of really liked it in the end. Go and see how I got on, eh? I'll just show you my screen right now, see how mucky it is. There you go. There's my screen. 13%. Oh, we're Rodney here. Hello. 
How are you getting on? Not a clue in the result, what, result wise, but keeping going. That's all I'm doing. He's got Billy Pugh here, who's a real ripper. Just been taken on by um, YT with Leo. YT riding with Leo, and he was beating him on one and two before, but Todd's putting some hot and laps in. Trying to do it again. I've said it. If he's going to beat him, he'll beat him on stage two on the pedal because Todd's super strong. So let's see. That's it. We are done. Results wise, I won, which I'm happy with. Duh. Todd uh, Billy Pugh won his category. Not really that much of a surprise. But who got second? Oh, I don't know. I don't Milfy know that. Anta, who is there. I can't put him. Who beat him? Good lad, Alfie. Todd was third. Stu was third, one was third. third. Stu was one thousandth of a second off third. Is that how much you're off the podium? Bad yeah, times. literally a thousandth of a Bad second. Times. Uh, I think actually the tracks got better throughout the day because uh, especially stage one was like almost unrideable at the beginning and then you got like well, a bit of a rut through all those whoops. But Rich asked and we told him and lessons learned, it's going to be, you know, a great series to carry on doing. Check out links in description, podcasts and all that sort of thing. Thank you for watching. See you soon. <sighs> Keep it pinned. Nice.